crashing into Cleveland's public square. News 5's Meg Shaw is live at the scene for us this morning. And Meg, unfortunately, you have some brand new information about that driver. Yeah, Cleveland police tells me the elderly man involved in this accident has died. I want to show you kind of what is left of this scene here. You can see a broken planter here in the middle of Superior Avenue, just feet away from Public Square. Now, obviously, this scene is clear this morning, but I want to show you some video of what it looked like just moments after this crash happened. Uh, it was taken from a user on Twitter who live streamed on Periscope. Uh, for about 15 minutes as law enforcement were working to get the man out of the car. Now, now it looks like, again, this driver hit the planter here in the middle of Superior Avenue, his car going airborne uh, before it landed on its side in the middle of Public Square. Now, it took crews on the scene several minutes to get the man out of the car, and it looks like they may have used the jaws of life to get him out. As you can see, the top of the car just completely uh, ripped open. Now, he was transported in critical condition, but again, Cleveland police tell me he has died from his injuries at Lutheran Hospital. Now, you may remember uh, the safety of Public Square was a large topic for Cleveland officials for several months as the middle of Public Square was closed to bus traffic for several months after the reopening of this brand new Public Square. Uh, the mayor citing safety concerns for pedestrians who were walking through there for or incidents just like this where a car or a bus may come crashing through Public Square where several people are, especially last night on a Friday night. But again, the man involved in this crash has died at Lutheran Hospital. Live in Cleveland, Meg Shaw, News 5.